VI Labs is a software company that makes convincing virtual pianos based on renowned acoustic pianos. And now their products are available directly from the PG Music website. You can find them by navigating to www.pgmusic.com, other software, Windows, or Mac. The VI Labs products are located under third party software and soft synths. For a complete guide to installing VI Labs products, please visit www.vilabsaudio.com and go to Support Installation Guide. This tutorial will show you how to use VI Labs virtual pianos with Band in a Box 2015 for Windows. But first, let's listen to some demos of the VI Labs Ravenscroft 275 virtual piano. These demos were created by loading MIDI super tracks in Band in a Box and opening the Ravenscroft 275 instrument into the UVI Workstation VSTI plugin. Here are the Ravenscroft 275 settings that were used for this sound. Here are the settings that were used for this sound. UVI Workstation acts as a host for Ravenscroft 275 and all of the True Keys pianos by VI Labs. This section will explain how to use UVI Workstation with Band in a Box for Windows. After following the installation guide on the VI Labs website, you can open Band in a Box. I have a classic rock project loaded right now. The piano is playing, but I want to replace it with MIDI Super Track instead. First, I will right click on the piano radio and go to Select MIDI Super Track for this track. Now I'm going to select this British Blues Invasion piano and go to OK. When prompted to add a high Q super patch, I will answer no, because I'm using a different instrument sound instead. Now click on the plugins icon and select real time VST slash DXI plugin settings. Highlight the piano button in the left column and select UVI Workstation VST from the first drop down box on the right. If you can't find it in the list, you can locate the VST manually by clicking on Add VSTI Plugin. Select the file titled UVI Workstation VST.dll from the directory where you installed it. Once the UVI Workstation is open, we can load the desired piano. If you are using the piano track in Band in a Box, the MIDI data will be playing on the Part 3 channel, so select that first. Then, double-click on the bar to open the instrument browser. Your installed instruments should be visible under Sound Banks. I am going to select Ravenscroft 275. Once the instrument is loaded, you can tweak it however you like, adjusting mic levels, EQ, reverb, etc. Advanced users can also adjust the velocity range and tuning. I'm going to start the song and listen to the piano. It sounds great, but it's a bit behind the beat. Sometimes this happens when a plugin requires memory and processing power. You can compensate by right clicking on the piano track and going to set track offset. I found in my testing that minus 10 worked well, but this will change from system to system. This concludes the tutorial on using VI Labs instruments with Band in a Box 2015 for Windows.